Welcome to another episode of Watch Once Over. My name is Big E. Today we're going to be looking at this beautiful Gorilla Fastback Drift Watch with the Wondering Hours Complication. This is an absolute cool beast. This one goes for $48.50. It's available right now at azfindtime.com. I'll put the information up over here. And this is in stock now. Now, this colorway right here is really cool, but before we do that, let's talk a little bit about um, how they put this together. The Wondering Hours complication is put together by Valshore for Gorilla. That's a, a manufacturer module, and underneath that module, which controls the Wondering complication, is a rock solid ETA 28. Uh, 24-2 with 38 hours of autonomy. Now, many, many high-end Swiss companies, including Gorilla, you see it's Swiss made, uses Valshore, uh for their movements and for special complications. Now, I'm going to unscrew the crown and pop it out and show you how this works real quick. Let me move in. Now, the wandering hours are these carbon fiber discs that when you advance the time the disc move see down there at six o'clock watch the disc see what i'm saying so to tell the time you simply have zero over here and 60 over here that is your 60 minutes so right now it would be it would read 10 o'clock on the nose so you read it from left to right that would be 10, 10, 10, 15, 10, 20, 10, 30, 10, 40. And as you can see, the 11 is coming around. And then the next one would be the 12, which would be midnight or noon, um, depending on it's day or, you know, daylight or nighttime. So that's 10, 59. And then coming up, you'd start over again at 11. So that's how the wondering complications work. It is very tricky to make these. Now, this watch beats at 28,800 vibrations per hour. It has a screw down crown, 100 meters of water resistance, sapphire crystal with anti-reflective coating on the inside and outside, beautifully done up PVD, uh, top case um, which is doubles as the dial that's actually uh, the movement that you're looking at and then the carbon floating disc of the wandering hours on this center disc that connects all of the um, three discs together then in the middle you have your orange second hand now going to the back you have a PVD coated Gorilla Rotor with sapphire back all titanium back on here carbon fiber case with aluminum and then ceramic on top so it's very anti uh, scratch resistant nice crown guards that are uh, screwed in a screw down crown that is huge and easy to operate beautiful FKM and Cordera uh, strap. It's a hybrid strap and this FKM rubber doesn't need breaking in. Now you have a titanium buckle strap uh, keepers that are signed with the Gorilla moniker as you can see and this watch is just it's just beautiful. I mean I, I have to say. Now this thing is chock full of loom. You are going to absolutely love the loom shot. 100 meters of water resistance on here, 38 hour power reserve, 28,800 vibrations per hour out of this watch. And and it's just very, very unique. Now, this is a, mm, for all intents and purposes, a square watch. I'll do the measurements after the loom shot. But let's loom this up. You do have Super Luminova on the hour scale up at top and on the numbers. 
that is going to be your uh, transitioning shot and here's your nighttime shot that is what you're going to get at night extremely powerful loom applied exceptionally well gorilla is all about high quality if you've never seen a gorilla watch look into the company check out the watches you're going to love them at some point i will be purchasing one of these I just personally can't afford it, but they are really, really nice. I love them. Now, I'm going to do a quick measurement on it and then show, show it to you on my wrist. Without the crown, the case is only going to be a 44, and then lug the lug of the case is going to be a 54, but the way this integrated strap turns down, it's going to fit real easy. Now, this is what it looks like on my wrist. My wrist is 7.25 inches. As you can see, there's no gaps in there, and it hugs the wrist great. I could recommend this easily down to a wrist of uh, 5.5 to 6 inches, especially if you like bigger watches. And you can also order this in different strap lengths, so that's pretty cool. All titanium hardware, titanium crown, and that thickness on this watch is going to be 14.3, so it's not that thick. And this back plate is also uh, titanium, and then the black glass is sapphire. So this is a high-quality watch, and that crown is about a 9 millimeter crown. So it's easy to get a good purchase on there and set this beautiful Wandering Hours Complication Gorilla Fastback Drift. This one's a beauty. Let me know what you guys think about this one. My name is Big E. That's the Watch Once Over for today. God bless. And as usual, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Please subscribe. Thank you for watching.